So, okay. We're going to have to revisit this because uh, I know a lot of people may be like, oh, we're going back to it. But yeah, we've got to finish this. We've got to finish it. Um, batteries are recharged. We are going to finish this for uh, KNN. Don't worry. Yeah, it's very hard. Um, oh, well, looks like uh, Portal done did reset everything again. Uh, so when we played this before, I think Aaron pretty much did drive us crazy. We, we've pretty much gone insane. Um, we got to this. Okay, we got to this part, and we got some gel on there. Now, I think we need to. Ah, uh, that's right. We need to, like, juggle some gel and get some gel on this panel here, I think, if I remember rightly. Just sort of reevaluate the situation a little bit. <laughs> We're talking Libby difficulty, probably. I can't even. To, to be fair, I, I, we, we went through some proper hardships along the way, didn't we? Does that keep me? Okay, so that doesn't fizzle my portals, which is all well and good, but we need some gel. Oh, all, I thought all Libby's maps were like 0 0.5. I don't think I've ever seen a difficult Libby Bapper map, ever. Okay, so what we actually need to do here is we need to juggle some gel. That is what we need to do. I need to put a pull on there, which is going to be that one there. Okay, so that's the gel juggle. Now, I need to remember. Deathwish, why, why did you just follow me, Deathwish? <laughs> How do we respawn? Oh, it's over there. We would need to do that, but then we need to respawn the cube this to work. Actually, no, not necessarily. Okay. I see something we could do here. Potentially. Uh, we need to... Still trying to get the notifications. Okay, I think that's my maybe what I need to do. Let me try that again. But I am actually need to kind of like try and this time instead, I need to like get out of the portal the right the right orientation. Okay. Okay, that's what I wanted to do. That's what I wanted to do. Okay, so now I don't need to rely on this. So now... If that's like the only, my only sticking point when I did this before, then 
I'm a little bit like, Pleh. All right, so now I just need to respawn. Uh, that was probably the wrong pole. Oh, we can go about this way, though, right? Yeah, we can go about this way. So, yeah, now I need to just to respawn this one, right? So, how do I respawn? You say I'm done. I'm not so sure. How do I like easily respawn that? Um Yeah, I got the ore the ore gate, but it's on the edge of the safety cube, which I'm not sure how to respawn. Of course, the only way, like, through here... Hold on. Can I, like, set a portal? Two minutes. We'll probably be here for another two hours in Deathwish. Alright, well, I've only got one portal. I haven't got a blue portal, so I've got to set something somewhere. Oh, wait a second. Does the... Hold on. Does that keyboard I respawn? I don't know. I don't know. Does it auto respawn? Sphere respawns. Thanks, Cannon. Alright, so let's think. Let's think. Aaron drove me crazy for long enough. We need to say goodbye. Okay, so hold on. Run. If I'm reading this right. Oh, yeah, but look. How? Uh, uh. No. I have to keep the portal there. That's a given. Then the only way back is to like, go through here. But respawning that there doesn't do anything for me, does it? Because I wouldn't be able to use this portal. And then I'd have to lose the portal. So I have to leave that in play there at the moment. Right? So how do I respawn the cube? Um... Right now to respawn it. Hold on. Maybe we maybe we do get rid of this for the time being. I wanna check my laser collision. Yep, that's off. Problem there is what? Problem there is, I think. I don't think I can get the safety cube back, can I? Without losing portals again. Think, Knock, think. How can we put this one to bed? Does that line up 
No, it doesn't line up over the button. I was wondering if I could like do something fancy with the cube. But I cannot. Okay, so what if I don't know how I do this? There's a way I can get back over here with no. I was wondering if I could like get back over there with like a. Portal. It's not in line with that, though. There's no gap in there, so no, that wouldn't work. That wouldn't work. How do we do this? How do we do it? So we do that. That's fair enough. Respawns. But that'll just drop down to the bottom again. And I can't go away from here. Without losing a portal. The question remains, how do we get back? Oh, well, we know how to get back. How do we do anything with this cube? This edge of safety, safety, this sphere, edge of safety cube, whatever you want to call it. How do we do anything with that? connections do okay I'll run I'll run through I will run through so this one uh, flips the panel this one obviously is fizzler and that one is fizzler on the or gate with the exit criteria moving over here we have the button here which is for the white gel there and then we have the button here which is the respawn mechanic for that, which drops down into this lower area down here. And this is behind uh, Fizzler and whatnot. That button there just allowed us to access this area here. Um, so I don't think I need to use any of this stuff again here. Yeah, that was the button to open that. Then, like I say, that dropped us down there. We had that little crusher area and whatnot. So, yeah, that's pretty much... I, I don't think we need to use any of that lower area. It is literally just what we've got there. So, how we use it. Now... Oh, um, no, I still need to respond. I thought maybe I'd overlooked the fact that I could just do something like this and then go over to here with a portal there. That takes me up and over, right?
So there is an option that we could respawn. We could respawn the weighted cube if we need to. I don't think that's going to help us. But it's a possibility. We have to have a portal there. So from here... Missed connection on the gel button? Oh yeah, okay, so what that does, that does the flip panel, so we can um, stop the cube from dropping down straight away. And what that actually does is we can respawn that and it can go into here, can't it? Okay, so if that's the case, if that's the case, we'll take this. Uh, I don't even know what you was on the last time I streamed, Deathwish. That's a pretty. It's a pretty difficult one, to be honest. Okay. May have seen this now. So, from here, we place this on the button here. And then we go back through the funnel here. Now we can fizzle this. Hopefully that should come through the portal. It should roll off the panel and drop through here. I can then catch this, place this here. Now we can get back. And we can respawn that cube there. Libby's word of words of wisdom right there. Please no more trolls, please no more trolls, please no more trolls. <laughs> oh man. We were so close when we played this before, but I just think I was I don't know, I think I when we played this before, I just felt so utterly like defeated. I'll be honest. Um, let me just check my notes a minute. I got a note. How many airboats Deathwish had the last time out? Normally keep a note. Could be that one. But I don't know how far my notes go back. Oh, massively overthinking. Massively. All right, I'm going to say, Deathwish, um, 55,136. That's going to be my official guess. Because I'm not really sure what you had last time. But uh, that's, that's what I'm going with. That's what I'm going with. Let's go, money. How you doing? Welcome, welcome. Hope you're well. All right, let's move on to the next. This is Surface Meltdown Puzzle Edition by JP. Yeah, that was my guess. That was my official guess, definitely. Right, let's have a quick look at what this one is all about. 
The playable version of Surface Meltdown. This fantastic map was originally made by T1 and Mystical Ace for the Thinking with Paul's mapping competition, Pitch Perfect. Here's linked to the original. The puzzle edition allows you to explore most every area that was not accessible before. I, all, I also wanted to keep the design and atmosphere as close as possible to the original map. As a result, any difference or new setup is made for the purpose of the puzzles and can be considered a clue. Okay. Puzzles are exper for ex experimented players. So I'm meant to be experienced, but no ninja moves, no throwing cubes, etc., aren't necessary. Three things you should know before playing. Exploring a little, you may find two secret passages, as well as seven crystals that can be collected. Two of the crystals are, are to be found in the first area, indoor. When you leave the indoor area, you cannot come back later, so don't forget to search those two crystals before leaving the ravine area. The next area, outdoor, is the ravine area. The bottom of the ravine is an additional area that you can reach via an elevator, not jumping, or you'll die. If you wonder how to reach the highest light bridge, um, da, 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 da. Um, when you have nothing to climb up on, jump and shoot will do it. If you're not sure what to do, <laughs> if you're not sure what to do, ask for a clue in the comments. Any feedback welcome. Faith testing by Stefan H. Miskalace, that alien boy, Mitt 3368. Thank you, guys. All right, just give me a second. I just need to see what that was about. All right, so, uh, yeah. <laughs> well, what can I say? I should have put myself on Do Not Disturb. Uh, all right. Anyway, let's uh, let's jump into this then, shall we? All right. So what all the crystals look like. All oh, those reflections look pretty. Those reflections look real pretty. The original puzzle was uh, pretty darn sweet, I'll be honest. Alright, we just... Ah! So that opens a funny looking door. <laughs> so that opens that door there. Is there, a, is there a way we can like pick stuff up? I don't think so. Okay. Ah, well, let's maybe jump on here and then jump up. That might help us. Here we go. Okay, we have the ability to create a portals now. A portals. Yes, we have the ability to create a portals. Yes, I'm pretty sure that's how it works. We all win, we all get ten dollars. Uh, I'll do it after if we finish this one, Deathwish, that's all right. All right, so. All surface there. can drop the cube on here. Excellent. I've not seen uh, any of the crystals as of yet. I'm not 
not really sure what it is I am meant to be looking for, of course. Pretty cool. So, I wonder if this is our first secret, although we can't go back, which is a um, bit of a worry. There is no way back. So I'm guessing that if there's no way back, we must be able to see that portal surface from inside here. Yeah, okay. Not on the portal surface, wasn't it? Okay. We just experimented. Experimented? No, we are experimenting. Hmm. Do need a laser though, so. It says E to pick up. How do you expect us to pick that up exactly? Draw I detect. Uh, okay. So we're over here. I guess we could use the pole surface in here. Can't go through there. I mean, I gotta go all the way back. That's a bit of a annoyance. Non-portable white surfaces for the win. Ah, man. All right, you gotta be really quick if you can. Uh, if you can do that, you gotta be really quick. We didn't try doing the... That just pushed that to the edge. I think it might have done. Yes. Ah, maybe instead of... Okay, maybe we need to reverse it, though. Okay, uh, all right, so what I want to do is this, and then this is our portal. Switch it to that, which will push it all the way to the end, and then turn it off. And then we want the port on there, and then we go back around again, then we should be able to pick the cube up now. We should. Able to. Okay. So we have this one. Now let's let's take it back over there. My area of concern, however, is now we need to bring the other cube through here, right? Okay, so if we need to do that, is there a way we can leave 
Oh, hold on. Well, maybe if we'd have angled that a little bit better, we could have just used this. Yeah, okay. Okay. I was thinking for a moment that I'd need to bring the, um, the other cube through, but no, we don't need to do that at all. Line this up properly. We should be able just to do that and that. So what did that do? Opened a switch. So I assume we can drop down here. We can. Caution, you just did things and stuff. Who knows what they did? Okay. So I assume that's going all the way across there. Yo, Mika, what's going on? How you doing? Welcome, welcome. Hope you had a good day, buddy. Okay, so now we need to do this, right? Cochrane! Resubscribed with the tier one for eight months. Knockers indeed, buddy. Knockers indeed. What's going on? Thank you very much for the subscription. Much appreciated, Conclan. Hope you're doing well. Happy New Year to you. All right, how do we get out of here? Are you still, um, still symptom-free, Mika? That is the conundrum, isn't it? Okay, so we can get the cube here, and, we can, and then we can maybe manipulate it from around this side. Okay, so we just need to drop a cube at the top. So, can we... grab this cube from here, I wonder. Pretty sure we can. is uh, a little bit awkward. Sure. Okay. We do that. We do that. Now we come around here. And we position the cube like that. And now we need to pick the laser up again. Should, in theory, allow us, if we intersected the laser, of course, allow us to open the gate. Let's just open there. Like something else just opened. I'm not sure what it was. Ah. No, at least it doesn't come from nowhere. At least it comes from there, T. Chapman. So, how you doing? Welcome, welcome. All right. Well then. I think at this point, um, we're not looking for crystals anymore. I think that's probably apparent. Given that we're already into the ravine area and uh, we haven't found a single one.
I'm meant to be here or not. I'll be brutally honest. I'm not sure. Kind of feels like I am. Okay. Okay, that's a light bridge. Holy crap, that's something. Okay. Right, it's not possible to get on it there. Guessing I'm not supposed to go on it here because there seems to be a a no clip or something stopping me from going any further here. Yeah, there's clips that are stopping me from going any further. So getting the light bridge at this stage potentially not the right thing to do. The issue we have at the moment here, though, now, is we don't have a way back. Okay. Well, actually, we totally do. Okay, I see how we could do this. Yes, okay. So, we'll turn the air control on again. Let's probably do that. I can't go that way. I just wanted to check. Okay, so what we will then do is go over to here. And if I'm right about this, what I should be able to do. I don't know about getting back up there, that's the only problem. From here. Hmm. Okay, I guess not. I thought maybe I could put this into the pipe and it would... Um... So I'm stuck. Um, I thought I'd be able to put that into the pipe and let it like go through and with the um, the, the airflow, it'd be, it would push it onto the button and give me the light bridge. And then I'd be able to get onto the light bridge up here, at the top here. Not that I really know at the minute what that would do for me and how that would benefit me. Okay. Um, but yeah, the... Uh, I am pretty stuck. So I'm just going to no clip out a minute. Can death wish. Weirdly, I can't because I haven't got mod options on my chat. So, uh, oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. So, I don't want to time you out. Um, bad streamer times out his mods. Okay, so... Well, we're dead. I suppose I should really check whether or not I can just simply Oh 
Alright, but... Fact of the matter is... Why don't I just do this? Right? Looks like, though, it's just to find one of the crystals. I, I'm, I'm going to a meter on that one. That's, that's, that, that's, I officially, I officially declare that as karma. For all those times we've played co-op and all I get is a rocket in the face. That is karma. <laughs> um. Okay, so. Oh. Maybe I need to get onto there. But how would I do that? Oh, there's a... <sighs> I'm so stupid. Uh, maybe not. I'm not so stupid. Because we can't go anywhere from here. Oh, we can. We can crouch, won't we? I don't know. It's game sometimes. Seriously. Okay, now we've done that. Now we've done that. Now we can go back over to here. I hope. where we came from. So, next question will be... What do I do with the cube? How do I get out of this area? Question actually. Where's his mod badge gone? Okay. Wow, I didn't realize like timing somebody out like removes their mod status. Even if I got over there, what could I do from over there?
quite sure. I we're meant to do this bit. Ah. I mean, that maybe seems a little cheaty. What do you guys think? Welcome to the world of Knock. Space bar doesn't work. There's a clip there that's stopping us from doing anything further there. So even if I like through through there, I don't see how that would benefit me. Oh, hold on. Look at this. So I that'd be cool if that was the, the solution, but it doesn't seem consistent enough to be right. It kind of worked. I got like a brief boost of speed there. So the other thing we could potentially do would be go back around. That was the wrong portal. So I can like, leave the cube here. It would like come down the tube when I turn the fan on. Okay, well, didn't work, unfortunately. Of ideas.
See, that just... It hits the button, but it's not... It's not consistent enough. So we may as well just like go back here and, and like put it put the portal back on here and ponder this again. So don't think dropping the the cube down there is like what we need to do. Hmm. The inconsistency principle. Well, I, I suppose if you want to look at it that way, then yes, I will agree. It's 100% inconsistent, so that's technically consistency. <laughs> the point is, though, even if I like, get across to here, right, let's assume... This is like what we're meant to do because you know it would make sense being all this and we'll assume we manage to get onto here and walk across to here what do we do from here and I suppose from here we could drop down onto one of these beams and walk across to Okay. Okay. That's a pole surface we didn't see before. Right, so um let's respawn the cube. It'll be easier. And then from here, let's just go back to this location here which we've been to before and put on there. Okay, we'll save there. Yeah, this is why we need the light bridge. What did that say about the light bridge? Sorry. Um, you wonder how to reach the high light bridge when you have nothing to climb on, jump and shoot or do. I don't know if it's is or not, Libby, to be fair, but I don't have anything else to go on at the moment. I would assume you shoot it from over there, but I, I don't know. What I wanted to try though over here is on an assumption that we can get to here. Can, I, can we jump on these beams? 
And can we get across to this area here via these beams? No, is the answer. But it did create a safe spot for us here. So... Oh, we can just walk here. Well, that makes things a lot easier, doesn't it? the light bridge here. Alright, so there's also a pulse surface there. Not sure how we would use that. Okay, so let's go back to get back to the plan. Me and my mama hopped in a U-Haul van. Uh, we was here, wasn't we? What we had. So how do we get across here? That's that's the one. Easy for me to say. Because for me it doesn't seem like there's anywhere I can jump on here to get onto this light bridge, but it does seem like it is the right thing to do. I'm climbing the railings, got clips on the railings, which is fine. There's nowhere I can jump to here. So I walk across here and it's like put it pushes me off the ramp so space bar only works when it wants to work that push Not really sure. Other than like what I've been trying to do here. Because if I go through here and jump there. It seems to work. I don't know. There's no... No, I can't get on any of the railing, Libby. So I can get on the pipe. There's a clip here to stop me from getting on the rail in here. There is also a clip that stops me from like jumping down there. have 
clips, so you can't actually stand on the, um, the railings, unfortunately. So... I don't know where we're going. Take me to the fireside, yeah, and then do what? Do what with after that, though, Deathwish? I, I did that before, I didn't see anywhere that I could really go. clip there, stop me from doing that. So... Yeah. Well, uh, Paul Sifts I could see from over here when I was here was there. There is a uh, diamond down there, though. It's just death. To me, I've got to go across here. With the light bridge, I walk across here. Okay. I can shoot on that on there to land on this beam here. I can then walk across here. That's that I opened up something there. Which allows me to shoot a portal onto that top area there. Gives me a portal surface somewhere else. Or a light bridge across to that side, like that. like from here I've got to ground I think I can jump from there so okay so that would mean I have to do this but I need the light bridge here so how would I then get up to there I, I yeah Unless, um, okay. See the glass stops that shot there. So
Not that. That's not the answer. Can you see how to use the bridge to get up to that area, Libby? Well, we've got to legitimately get to that area first before we can really start playing around with that. I just don't... I don't know. To me, it does seem like you've got to use that. See, this, this portal shoots... It appears too high on this wall. To do a jump from here. It's in a it's portal magneted to like a specific a specific place. see from here okay you can see that pole surface from here Is this solid oh hello Hang about Is that just a way for us to see that surface? Okay. Okay, we may have found our way across. That's why we need to that. Okay, so if we're here. Okay. Oh, I've got a clip there to stop us from going any further there. Is there a way? What can we do from there? All right, safe doing that. We legit, we have now legitimately got to this position. Okay, we are legitimately here. I don't think I can, with my portal skills, I don't think I can, like, make... you got to jump from here. I don't think I can make it. I think I'm going to be able to make this jump. Oh. So, hold on. Hold on. Why, why was there a clip here before that was stopping me? But yet now I'm allowed to walk on it. Okay, um, sure. Sure. Okay. Well, we legitimately found a way. To do that. Right, 
dodgy button. Okay, so... I think here what I'm supposed to do is this. Then... What? Because I can't place one there. I can't crawl through there. It's too short. So we can't make that. Don't think we can make that. But if I had the light bridge, let's just say, that's hypothetically speaking, I do think we need to get up to here. So from here, we can walk around over here and place that on there and walk across there. Okay. So we do need to see a find a way to walk over to there. So how do we get from A to B? Because every time I do that, I'm just banging my head on the ceiling. Is it possible? We have already done it. Is it possible then to go back? Ah, okay, yeah, okay. That's how we do it. Go back. Walk through here. Okay. We'll get in places. Now we can do this, do that, and jump here, crouch through here, and over to here, portal on there, save, walk over here. this guess we do but I don't see a way to get around it from here so maybe not I tried the crouch walk death wish. Okay, I need to jump as well as crouch. My bad. Don't know how to uh, play portal still, clearly. Hey.
in the uh So here we've lost the light bridge. I'm guessing that's not good. So I guess and that's not very helpful. It's pretty crazy though to think like this this map. This map came from um Oh, okay. Yeah, this map was um, originally just like a, a map with no puzzle. Quite crazy to think. This is what some mad person came up with. Gee, shall we click through there? So I need to take the cube with me. Because we can always respawn another one. Seriously overcomplicated sky freight map? Perhaps. Alright, well, uh, it doesn't look like we're taking the cube with us. There's another... Uh, the star there. Okay. All right, so... We need a cube. Interesting. So what can we do with that? Well, we can put a portal there. Potentially we can get it back. what I've done wrong. What I actually need to do, because this is all grated, right? So, hoping I can take this and...
Yeah, on or off? I mean... I thought, I thought, like, what I could do would be to... Initially, put the cube through there, but I can't, like, walk through here. I thought I could maybe drop the cube down... in here, right? Something like that. I mean, I can do that. Go on, Coco. Yeah, I, I, we, we've been struggling with this, I'll be honest. It's been a struggle. I mean, I've just got the cube through here, but I'm pretty sure that's not what I was meant to do. Logic, to me, would say... Light bridge on there? Although, I don't know if the light bridge would actually work in that position. I, it might be too steep an angle for the light bridge. So now what do I... Oh. Didn't see that funnel before. Probably because it wasn't active. Alright. That's based on that. What what is that even doing? I don't know what that was doing. Oh. Oh, we can go for a ride on the minecart. You managed to trap yourself, Coco? Okay, I, I kind of get that. I guess I just walk back then, right?
And yeah, I'm guessing I walk back. We put a. I still don't really know what, what, what did this. What did this button do? I've, okay, I guess we're not going back that way then. That's where you got stuck, Coco. I'll go back that way now. What if I was still here? I wonder if that's what the button does. Okay, so it's a, it's a one time activation. get back from here though um. I don't understand like why why is this gate locked? What does this button do? And the fact that I drop down here means I'm trapped. No way to push the minecart back. I mean, great, we found a new crystal. I'm guessing this is... Oh wow, okay. Okay. I guess that solves your uh, that solves your your question, Coco, as to what you do. Okay. Moving on. What do we do from here? Um Oh, 
Missed that one. Okay. Then we can go back over here. Can I drop down? Thank you. So from here, okay, what I should have done is not come down here at all. Let's go back over here. So we have that pole surface there. What we actually want to do is go over here. Found a secret passage. A secret passage was found. Okay. So, what is that? There's a funnel over here. Alright, so now I want to do that. Respawn this. Go through here. Bar here I can stand on. Okay. Drop down here, I guess. to do anything uh, okay what do I do I guess. I don't know if this is the right, but it seems to be working. the button. Are we done? Oh, we found an elevator. Um, yeah, it was very disjointed for me. I feel very disjointed. Um, it was kind of like you, you're all kind of saying, like they've just bolted on the puzzle onto the map, which is obviously what they've done. But 
I don't know, just it's just not really very clear a lot of the time as to what you're actually meant to be doing. Um, so, yeah, I mean, so they've done a good job to, you know, to, to, to put a puzzle in it. I just don't think it's the right way to go about puzzle design, if I'm completely honest. Um, so, yeah, not not a massive fan of that one. Not a massive fan of that one at all. Um, yeah. Okay. Okay, so next up in the queue, if we're going in order, this. Um, but looking at the time, you want to get into this right now because uh, by the time we actually get the sort of, um, by the time we get into it and bits and pieces, it'll be time to kind of stop it. So I, my, my plan is after seeing this, I think we'll do this on um, Monday. So we'll come and do this from Libby on Monday. Um, so yeah, we're just going to pick up the queue from here, carrying on um, this one. Hope that's all right with you, Libby, by the way. Hope you don't mind. I'd rather like start the stream afresh and jump like straight into it from from uh, from the off. And another hall breach. Let's all give a big hand. I did see it was a six out of ten. I did check like the difficulty rating. Um, UFO of death. That's literally all we get. All right. I get a yikes in the chat. I mean, sure. 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 You didn't see anything. <laughs> you didn't see anything at all. All right, this one is faint, and it's from a Dido Killer. I think Di oh, Dido Killer is here. Dido Killer is here indeed. Um, all right, so we've got easy to medium, no ninja moves, no triangles, no cube juggling, very minimal timing is intended. Huge thanks to Pie Creeper and Dark Rose for playtesting. Hope you enjoy it, and feel free to give any feedback. Oh, I got some feedback for you already. As long as they ain't got a death trap. This next test it's involves a thumbs up from me. grills. Remember, I told you about them in the last test area that did not have one. Go crazy. How's it going, my friend? Welcome, welcome. Hope you're well. Okay. So, what do we need to do with this? So this reverses the polarity of the funnel. We need to open this, which is controlled by something at the top, which we can't see from here. Wondering, however, if we can see it from over here. We might be able to. Hmm. 
Okay, so conductive plates. We need to take the cube through to there if we can. Not sure how we're going to do that though at the moment. We can, however, we can get across there ourselves at the moment if we ride in the funnel. Like so. Okay. Now we go drop down here and we push this onto here. That should open up the um do free Watsy theme as you hear over here. Oh, wait a second, we can't do that just like that. Ah, okay. Um, okay, what we should have done instead is what? Congrats on uh, solving a hard map, crazy. Okay, so... How do I... I could get... Uh, I can't get that because this... This is the causes the issue, doesn't it? Okay. So. Indeed, crazy. I don't expect anybody to uh, donate. It's just very generous if you do, but it's never expected. So, uh, yeah, it's completely fine. I would just have you here dropping by and saying hi. So I could do that to there. I mean, this is interesting, actually. It's very interesting. Everything that you would think to do normally is behind a fizzler, and we obviously we need to open the fizzler up to be able to proceed. Um, we could of course like go across to the other side here, although it wouldn't really give us any benefit at the moment. Square just. Respawns the cube. What I could do though, um, go across to here. I don't think this like changes or does anything for us as such. We still don't have a way to see. Anything from there. I was thinking about could we, with this cube, whether it was possible to like funnel it up. But I don't think it is. So crazy. Thanks for by, saying hi. Appreciate it as always. Good weekend. Uh, it's a capital Y for yikes.
Okay, so we can probably fling across here. But we need that fizzler to be open first. It does only control that one fizzler, doesn't it? Yes, it does. Almost feels like we need another cube from somewhere. Not that there is one. I'm pretty sure this isn't going to work, but. save. Yeah, we'll stop doing that right now. <sighs> okay, so... How can we work around these fizzlers? can push it over to there. Oh, hold on. Yeah, okay. That's probably it. Alright. Looking at this. Look at a more simplified view here. Alright, so, we do this, where does this go? Alright, that gets fizzled. Can I? Can I manipulate this in a way? Honestly, I can't really answer that question at the minute. Alright, so... Get in the funnel. Okay. 
Okay. Then... Yeah, you see, the problem here is... That's all well and good. But I would need the funnel on there a little bit earlier, wouldn't I? Okay. Could work if I actually sort myself out and shoot the right portals in the right positions. I've messed it up again. I didn't freaking shoot the portal. I've got to do that. Shoot the portal. Because what I'm thinking is, when, when I do that, the idea is, I go across to here and I do that. And that is actually going to stop the cube from fizzling in the funnel. Uh, fizzling... Fizzling in the funnel. Fizzling on the laser. That's what I'm taking from that. I mean, I'm not hearing any, like, moans and groans at the minute that um, I'm potentially breaking, so... Why does it go high enough? It doesn't go high enough, but I should be able to come out of here, drop, and catch. All right. Yeah, I don't know. I, I feel like it's a bit too... Maybe a bit too... Uh, time... Restrictive, maybe. Maybe that's not what I'm meant to be doing. Um... Interesting how this isolation time is affecting my mental health. I such a negative effect on mental health. It's also giving me time to be alone with my thoughts. I can't escape those. And I have to face them. So I have learnt a lot of things with the isolation time in tiny room, which is spent maybe 23 hours a day. I haven't been able to focus on my university stuff in isolation due to the, the amount of things. It's always good to have time to um, ponder your thoughts, Mika. I just, um, as long as you obviously feel like it's benefiting you. And it's um, bettering your um, overall mental state. I could get out of the funnel. Is that right? I mean, just I suppose just give me a yay or an a simple yay or an a. Am I? Is this like breaking or? I don't see another way around the fizzler though at the minute, which is it's not right. Okay. Huh. 
Okay, so how else do we get around these fizzlers? That's the big question. Because it's conductive plates for both this one and this one. I mean, I'm seeing some potential moves where we could have the cube on there, reverse funnel, pull myself through the funnel. Um, walk down there, take the cube off. Hold me though, would it? Because if I was doing that, um, cube would be in there. I wouldn't be able to get back into the funnel. Seeing so like funnel myself up there, maybe do some sort of fling across to there. I'm like pretty pretty sure it's not as complicated as I make, but. At the moment, I'm not seeing it. I'm not seeing how to get around these fizzlers. I was on the right track, but the execution wasn't there. Hmm. Okay, but then what else could I have done?
I don't know what else I could do, though, other than this non-elegant solution. That's what I'm thinking. Yo, Chad, what's going on, buddy? Welcome, welcome. But you're saying that's not the right thing, Dido, right? that you've got a, a positive approach to it, Mika. Definitely. Yeah, not too bad. Thanks, Chad. Not too bad. Um, definitely better than I was over the Christmas period. How could I... Okay, I think I see how to do it now. I think I see how you want me to do it. So, we could do instead... I think... That, that, drop down here instead. Thanks for the kappa bits. Fizzlers are one and a half inches thick. I did not know that. No, I did not. All right, there we go. That's a much more elegant solution. A much more elegant way of doing that. Okay, excellent. Right. So, now what? I'm thinking... We need to place... That's your witch. Oh. Fiddlesticks. What now? Well, I'll tell you what now. That wasn't the right thing to do. Alright, so what we're going to do now? We're going to do that there. Boom. All there. Portal. There? Oh, you know what I should have done? Yeah, I know what I should have done. Okay, let's do that. And... That. And we can pull the cube back over here. Like so. I hope. Fingers crossed, maybe. Maybe. There it is. There she is. Alright, fizzle that so don't go anywhere. Hopefully that wasn't a mistake. Okay. Now I have the cube here. So 
we have this now. How does this help us? I don't know if we need that, to be fair. It's gonna hinder us maybe more than it helps us. What it will allow me to do, though, is do that. Do that. That would have probably been a lot easier, actually, if I hadn't of, um, kind of reversed the funnel. Would have been an easier setup, I think. Okay. So now we have this through to here. I think we can probably do this. over to here. All well and good. However, I'm going to want to be up here, portal up there, funnel across, so that I can then also respawn the cube. Take it easy, Mika. Have a good weekend, buddy. We'll catch you again soon. Okay, so we leave that there for now. So first now we're going to set this up. I can navigate stairs. Excuse me. Okay, so we have that, we have that. It's going to get us across to there. How do we respawn the cube? Uh, yes, I have a sit-stand desk, Chad. Uh, I really like it. I like having the like the freedom to be able to. Um, I like having the freedom, like to, like be able to spend some of my working day stood and some of it sat. Helps with my posture mas massively and takes a lot of pressure off like my lower back and the the bottom of my spine, which I was starting to have some um, some issues with. So yeah, for me, I absolutely love it. All right, how do we do this? How do we do this? Mm. Um, I don't know how much it costs because um, I think my boss, my boss, I think my boss bought, actually bought this for me. So um, yeah. Exactly, Deathwish. Exactly. All right, how are we going to respawn this cube? Please. about pretty please I think it's pretty obvious we can't do it from here so what is the step that we're missing
We've got to use the funnel. Because this fizzle will be shut, therefore... Unless we can... Unless we could... I'm just going to go back temporarily just to what we had here. So here we pulled the cube through, right? It's a thing that we did. Is there anything else I could do? MySQL says no. MySQL broken pole. There we go. Um, yes, yeah, so we pulled it through. I think that's right. I think what we did is right. I believe. I also believe it's getting late. So we do that, we do that. What if I was able to... I think of ways that I could like respawn stuff. Timer. It's on the timer. It's instant. All right. Time was just a bit confusing. I thought maybe it was like delayed slightly, but no. I'm not seeing it. Not seeing a way to respawn this cube.
Portals, I think, are in the right positions now. I mean, I can see that surface there. The problem with that is... It doesn't work with, like, the cube would have to be on that button. And then it doesn't work with any of the other configurations. Mm. So that wouldn't work at all. That wouldn't work. We can always use an airboat. Hold on. Maybe not. Trying different things here. Um, see, that allows us to walk through and there. So why could I not just do... So we'll see that from there. Yeah, I mean... That's what I was thinking there. If I could then activate the funnel. I feel this is important. I haven't used this yet. That's quite concerning that I haven't used that bridge. What's going on? How would I use the bridge though? The only way I could use the bridge would be if I could open up the Fizzler first. Right? So I could open up the Fizzler, walk through, and walk back over to here. But. Do. 
because... What if I could... So, chat, thanks for stopping by, appreciate it. I got nothing. Am I even in like the right setup here? Is this the right setup or have I missed some steps? Because... Uh... Yeah, somebody tell Adam to refresh. Save state is perfect, keep going.
everything in the chamber is used, that would potentially indicate that I need to get the cube back out here then. I mean, one thing I haven't done yet, I kind of touched on it before. This way. So that's something different. Okay, so we've now used the bridge. I think we're there. Possibly, I think we're there. What I can now do... Oh, crap. Okay. Okay, so let's let's do that again. Uh, what are we going to do? All right, this goes here. Portal. Portal. Funnel. Portal. Cross. Portal. I don't think I should have done that, should I? Should have kept my portal there, so I could have gone through and picked up the cube. Well, let me go back a minute, because I don't think that was right. Come on, we got this. We got this. Okay, that stays there like that. Next, we need to change orange. You know what? We'll just do it like this instead. Let's 
Still not quite there, though, is it? Because now the issue is we... Bottle in the right place, do we? What if I was to fire down there and there? Instead of on here. Doesn't seem to help. I mean, it's not something as, like, stupid and simple as this, is it? Oh my goodness, it was. <laughs> oh, man. Overcomplication. Very not completely bad. Very completely terrible. <laughs> That's a good one, Dino Killer. Good job on that one. Poor Ponky, what's going on? You've joined us right at the death, my man. But I uh, hope you're doing well. But guys, that's going to be it for tonight. Thank you very much, everybody, for uh, tuning in. We'll be back next week on Monday, Tuesday, and Saturday with three more Portal 2 Community Chamber streams. And uh, Monday, we'll be kicking things off with um, Libby's map um, called First and goal, so expect that one to uh, last uh, quite some time. But guys, thank you very much, everybody, for tuning in. I really do appreciate your support, as always. And until next time, I've been Nock. You've been awesome. Stay safe, have a great weekend, and happy gaming. Bye, guys.